Hello friends, Radhika Ravi Kumar here. So now let us continue with the cron tab. In the previous tutorial, I've already told you what is cron tab, why we use it, and also the syntax of the cron tab as shown here. So now let us make make use of this uh, cron tab tool and see how it will work. So my uh, scenario right now is uh, I'm going to uh, make a task to run every minute. Okay. So to do that, first you need to have a script. Okay. In that script, you are going to specify the task that you want to perform. So now, let me create a script called, um, let me mention it as task.sh. Okay. So here, uh, my requirement is, I am going to mention a command called cal. And this cal should get appended to a file that is residing in this path. I'll mention the file name as test1.txt. Okay, so I want the result of this cal to get appended to this file called test1.txt every minute. So okay, that is my requirement right now. So I'll just uh, save this file and exit. Okay, now the script is ready. So before going to cron tab, make sure that the script has all the permissions, like uh, all the read, write, execute permissions. Okay. Because uh, sometimes whenever you uh, are running the cron tab, it might not it it might not work. So just make sure that you are change giving change mode to 777 to your script. That is task dot sh. Once after doing this, yeah, now the script is having all the permissions. Now we'll go to the cron tab. Okay. So now in order to edit a cron tab, you need to say cron tab hyphen e this is the command hyphen e okay so once you do that you can see the vi editor is coming up again here so here you need to mention uh, the whatever syntax that i've already taught you the minute hour all those things that you need to mention it here so as i said i want to run the task every minute right so i'm going to mention star 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 for everything for all the things like for minute hour day of the month then the um, you know the week everything because uh, it's going to be every minute so five stars and then i'm going to mention the path where my script is lying so i'm going to say home slash oracle slash desktop slash my script name was task dot sh okay so this this is how you need to mention your uh, uh, you know cron tab for if you want to run the script for every minute, then you need to mention it in this way. Okay, then escape. Just uh, how you used to uh, do it for your VI editor. Same way, just uh, save and quit. So you can see that uh, the cron tab installing new cron tab. So you can see the cron tab has started. So now after a minute, uh, a file will get generated here in my desktop as test1.txt having the result of uh, calculate i mean calendar you can see now presently there is no such file we'll come back and see after a minute what exactly has happened okay so before that we'll see uh, some of the options that are available for for cron tab like the options like cron tab hyphen e which i've already shown you we have uh, used it here in order to edit your cron tab file you'll be using cron tab hyphen e then if you want to display your cron tab file then cron tab hyphen l then if you want to remove your cron tab then you can use cron tab hyphen r okay so these are the options that are generally used there are some other options like hyphen a hyphen v hyphen u and all so these things you can know by using man command so this is what is about the cron tab now uh, let us just uh, go back and see whether a file has been generated yeah you can see here in our desktop the test1.txt has been uh, created now when i open this uh, file you can see the cal the result of the cal has been uh, appended again when i see in the next minute again the you know calendar another calendar would have uh, that is again the same thing would have got appended so this up i'm uh, you know uh, you can uh, make use of the cron tab in order to run a task at a specific time so the same way however i've done it for every minute you can do it uh, uh, like for you can also mention the 
if you want to run a your task uh, twice in a day at as i said at 11 and 4 pm or if you want to run only in the week days from this particular time so for that and all you can make use of this cron tab so hope you guys have understood if there any queries then please do mail me uh, if you have any queries like uh, if you want to perform a specific task you have question regarding this cron tab and all then please do mail me i'll try to answer it answer your queries as soon as possible uh, thank you very much for watching and also please do subscribe to my channel and uh, like my videos too thank you very much for watching